Hi everybody, happy whatever day it is because I'm not quite sure when I'm going to upload this but I am way late on getting my July favorites up so here we are. So I have some pretty epic favorites. <laughs> pretty epic. I have just some things I really like really love. So let's get into it. So the first thing I want to address is the lips. I feel like this might become my new signature color. Oh hello, did I mention the elephant in the room? I have new hair. <laughs> Duh. Um, so I have cut a good chunk of my hair off <laughs> um, and I've lightened it up and I really like it if you guys don't you don't need to be rude and tell me but I was just so ready for a change I've had long red hair for like the last three years and I was just I was I was ready I was I needed something new so this is my new do I'm digging it I don't my hair is not wet for like a week after I shower because it's not so long and thick and crazy I mean it's still thick but it's not as long. <laughs> Alright, back to the favorites. So this, 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 this lip. <laughs> this is pretty, pretty, <laughs> can't even speak. This is likely going to become my new signature color. I think it is just perfection. It's described as an electric watermelon, and it is. It's just, it has the nice perfect mix of pink and red with a little bit of brightness to it. This is So Sophia from Marc Jacobs. The formula is super creamy pigmented, rich, beautiful on the lips. It disguises any dryness. My lips are chapped and gross and peeling, but this mimics healthy looking lips. Like it makes it look better. So yes. So yes, it's worth the price. The packaging is super fancy and it's magnetic. So it, and it feels weighty. So you get what you pay for. A quality lipstick with nice packaging as well. This color, So Sophia, just makes me happy. It's bright, it's vibrant, but it's nothing it's nothing that's like gonna pop at you and scream at you where you're like, whoa, those are some really bright lips. It's just a nice complimenting bright lip and it's an easy way to wear and pull off a bright lip. There is what she looks like in all her glory. I mean, just look at that color. Can we? Can we? Love. So I've been wearing this a couple times a week, so two times a week for this whole month, which is pretty big because I have a big lip lipstick collection and can't speak. Because I have a big lipstick collection, it's pretty big, so love. Something else I have been so loving this month, this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills. It's the Shadow Couture World Traveler Palette, as I drop it. It's such a beautiful mix of colors. These four, these, this warm quadrant has been like my everyday eye look, and then I love mixing like this gold and purple together the gold and blue together and fun looks. It's just a really pretty palette. I love pretty much every shade in here. Especially this pink champagne gives me life, guys. Just look at that color. There it is there. It's so pretty, that pink champagne. If you foil it on the lids, oh, guys, it's gorgeous. It's so shiny and reflective. And I really love these matte colors, the fudge and the Morocco. Such beautiful crease colors. These are very pigmented and very easy to work with. So there's just a couple swatches of like three of my most favorite colors. Pink Champagne, Morocco, and Fudge. Beautiful colors. This has been a humongous hit this month. I love it. I've been wearing it every day since they bought it. I really like it. Can we talk about Anastasia's palettes and how they're so affordable? This is $30. Like, what? So many other like makeup palettes are like $40, $50 and stuff, but this is $30. I think it's such a great bang for your buck. If you're thinking about it, I would highly suggest it. All the colors are beautiful, pigmented, smooth, rich, beautiful eyeshadows. I really like them. Okay, this is the blush. It's been on my cheeks pretty much all month long. I have it on today. It's just the perfect complimenting soft shimmery peach with a little bit of a gold iridescence to it. It just gives you a really nice glow to your face without looking fake and over the top. It just gives you that perfect flush. It is so gorgeous. This is in the color I will always love you and I just, I love it so much. And yes, I will always love this blush. There's a swatch of it right there. So you can just see it's a beautiful coral peach with some gold sheen to it. It's gorgeous. Can you hear my wrist popping? Like, I'm going to suffer arthritis, I just know it. <laughs> but anyways, even the packaging is super cute. It has some bunnies embossed on it with the Too Faced logo. And hello, it's shaped like a heart. Need I say more? Need I say more? No, it's beautiful. Love it.
Another favor this month, um, this has pretty much just been my everyday eye look. I have on the Anastasia Shadow Couture Palette. Just a really nice dusting, just a nice warm, light, smoky eye, perfect for daytime and perfect for work. And I just use a bronzy eyeliner. This is a NYX Slide On, Glide On, Stay On, definitely a turn on, waterproof, extreme shine eyeliner. <laughs> Long name. But this is in the color Golden Bronze. There it is there. You can see it's just such a rich, beautiful bronze color. It stays all day. It doesn't smudge. It doesn't melt off. And I just feel like if you have blue eyes or green eyes, it's going to help them pop. I just love it. And they're super affordable from the drugstore and a really great product. Love it. Okay, and last for makeup wise, I've been using this It Cosmetics Build a Brow and Universal Taupe. And I've also been using it with the Coordinating Heavenly Luxe Build a Brow number 12 brush. These are like a little set together. It's called a Waterproof 5-in-1 Microfiber Cream Gel Stain. Um, so <laughs> quite a long name as well, a lot of claims. But it just goes on and smooths out the eyebrows really well. And if you have bald spots in your eyebrows, it just helps to kind of build it up. And I just love that it lasts all day long. Especially it's been so stinking hot here and like I've been sweating my butt off. But my eyebrows are staying on, so that's always a plus. So I really like it and I just feel like the brush, the formula makes really nice brows and it makes it really fast and easy in the morning and it stays all day. Love, 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 love. Last but certainly not least, this is my favorite hair care product of the month. Um, it's from Dry Bar and it's the Triple Sec and it's a 3-in-1. So it texturizes, amplifies, and refreshes. So it's kind of like a dry shampoo, texture spray, and a volume enhancer all in one. I love this. It smells fabulous. First of all, it's oh so good. Do you see? Do you see that? Look at that. Just from a little bit, you could hold it up. Boom, volume. But anyways, I love this, especially when I'm curling my hair, if I want a little bit more volume. I could just fluff some of this in, fluff it around, turn my head upside down, shake it around, and then I have massive volume. So if you're someone who's looking for volume, you have flat hair, or if you just like, are like me, I have heavy hair, so it weighs it down. If you need a little bit of extra fluff, this is definitely, definitely the thing for you. It's so good. I highly suggest it. It was well worth the money. And it's really good as like a dry shampoo to refresh your hair, as well as make it smell good, make it look good, absorb the greasy oilness, and give you volume. It's fabulous. I love it. You should try it. <laughs> okay, so those are my favorites of the month. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any favorites or hits of the month, please leave them down in the comments section below or leave me any recommendations. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Heart you guys all. Bye, everybody.